Italia has been ravaged by significant floods, over 20 rivers have broken their banks, and at least 13 people have perished. After six months' worth of rain fell in a day and a half, hundreds of locals were forced to leave their homes. This is a report. Floods in Italy's northern Emilia-Romania area have killed numerous people and damaged billions of euros worth of property, according to the regional governor on Thursday. This week's severe downpours decimated the region's east, flooding more than 20 rivers. Roads have been damaged and destroyed, and there have been hundreds of landslides. President of Emilia-Romania region, Stefano Bernaccini spoke about the extent of the damage inflicted by the disaster. The weather is like an earthquake again. With more than 5,000 farms submerged, agriculture has been severely impacted. Approximately 10,000 people had to be forcibly removed from their houses, and many of those who remained had no access to power. One of the dead washed up on a beach some 12 miles from her house after being carried away by the tide. As the rain ceased and the flood waters largely retreated, residents of the town of Chesarnia were able to reach their mud-covered homes. Maurizio Cola and Raphael Azani, a husband and couple, returned to discover their wedding pictures destroyed. It was Emilia Romania's second experience with terrible weather this month. Months of drought that had dried up the soil were followed by strong rainfall. According to meteorologists, this decreased the ability to absorb water. Environmental groups including the WWF attribute the disaster's escalation to the loss of water absorbing trees and vegetation along the riverways. The government will not force strict CO2 reduction rates on local industries or require large polluting nations outside to do the same, according to Italy's agricultural minister. However, he admitted that climate change was to blame for the drought and insisted that the nation needed to adapt.